The much-awaited Heartland Season 17 has come to an end with its last episode 10, which aired on December 4. The family drama show is based on the life of a family that lives in Heartland and runs a ranch. It's full of horses, family drama, and comedy at times too, making it a perfect family show. In the opening scene of episode 10, Jack is observing the sky and believes that clouds portend bad luck, which turns out to be true. In the first part of the episodes, the family's circumstances don't seem to be going well. The family is preoccupied with their personal life and planning for Shane and Chloe's weddings. Lou, Tim and Jack are busy making their way up to Garland Foods for Heartland Beef, while Lou's daughter, Katie, is busy getting used to her new bike. Amy is busy working with Powder to get him fully healed. When Amy is working on the farm to help Powder heal, she gets to spend a lot of time with Nathan. This allows them plenty of room to converse, and they exchange perspectives on relationships. Amy views things positively, but Nathan seems to have a very negative outlook on marriage and love. He expresses to Amy his belief that a person is not intended to spend their entire life with a single individual. We also learn that his negative perspective on relationships is likely the result of his failed marriage. By the end of the episode, Nathan and Amy had improved their relationship by finding points of agreement and understanding one another better. Since Fred was let go from his job, Lou, Tim, and Jack had to fight to settle a Heartland beef dispute with Garland Foods. However, the three never give up and persevere in trying to pitch their company to the new Garland Foods executives. However, we are not privy to their eventual triumph. And this serves as a poignant illustration of how uncertainty is a natural part of life and why it is crucial to press on without giving up. Before their wedding, Shane and Chloe overcome various obstacles and become more honest with one another, which only serves to deepen their love. Tension between the two grows as a result of Shane's uncertainty about moving to London after his wedding and his company's promotion offer. At first, there was some confusion regarding their decision. After much deliberation, the two decide against attending the wedding in London. In Heartland, they exchange vows to last a lifetime. We witness Jane and Tim having heartfelt conversations with one another, which obviously strengthens their bond. In addition to building a gazebo for Shane and Chloe's wedding, Tim is asked by Shane to be his best man. We witness Tim telling Shane how pleased he is of him in one instance. In this episode, the father-son relationship gets closer. This episode also demonstrates Katie's determination to learn how to jump from her bike, despite her first fear. She is inspired to try it nevertheless after spending some time with her family, and by the end of the episode, she is successfully learning how to jump on her bike, claiming victory. Without the entire family enjoying some priceless time together, how could a Heartland season come to an end? Yes, there is a scene in which the family rides a cattle in the episode, and it's their first time doing so in a very long time. Lissa asked them to do this because it was her birthday, and they complied. Following the journey, Jack informs everyone that although everything is transient and will continue, family is what really counts and should be prioritized above all else. The episode ends with Shane and Chloe getting married in a joyful ceremony, and Powder becoming considerably better with Amy's assistance. The family continues to go forward with hope in spite of the obstacles, and Heartland Season 17 Episode 10 concluded on a positive note. However, there will be plenty to enjoy in Heartland's upcoming season. What happens to Nathan and Amy's relationship? And what about Heartland beef? What kind of life can Shane and Chloe expect after marriage? Stay connected with us as we will be the first to inform you about any updates regarding the upcoming season.